though, man. So, Complex is being forced to apologize after having a huge mistake, my boy. A crazy mistake after they mistook Kasanat's homeboy, that's an AMP, Chris Next Door, for his cameraman, Chris V. His cameraman who has some idle, some PDF uh, allegations on his name. I'm going to catch y'all up with that towards the end of the video. We did go over that on a live stream. We, we found out live together. Make sure y'all have notifications on for whenever I live stream. But um, I'm going to show y'all the clip as far as breaking down that situation. Kai was pissed off about this mistake. In Complex, all they had to do was be an actual media organization and do their own research. But they did not. They did not. And Kai said he was severing all ties. But in response to that, which I'll play y'all in a few, in response to that, they say, we are sorry, Chris, next door. During the overnight hours of July 30th, 2024, Complex erroneously published a story involving members of the AMP Collective. The story, which detailed allegations of inappropriate behavior involving a minor by cameraman Chris V, conflated accused with streamer Chris Next Door in a body copy and featured lead artwork that included Chris Next Door. When the error was brought to the attention of the editorial board, all associated social postings were deleted immediately and the story was promptly amended with the correction. Complex would like to extend a sincere apology to Chris Next Door and all those affected by this lapse in journalistic diligence. Complex has severed its relationship with the writer responsible for publishing the post in question and the editorial board has instituted new protocols to ensure that mistakes of this nature do not happen again. So they fired the writer. Okay, I'm reading this for the first time. So they fired the writer. Okay, okay, what y'all think about that, man? So uh, Chris Next Door responded saying, immediate? immediate that's cap my lawyer spoke to the president of complex twice at 1 a.m and told him about it someone on the editorial team finally fixed it around 6 a.m this apology five days late that's because they had academics on the ass too because you know academics was beefing with them because of the write-up they did after giving him number one on the hip-hop media's personality list and they still said some slanderous things not slanderous but um they just talked about them in the article so they fired somebody about that that's crazy all right so let's catch y'all up with how we got to this point all right let's dub back to the stream when i found out about the situation costing that it gets emotional and starts crying after hearing about not that not that at the hearing about some dude named Chris V, who is the cameraman for AMP, was talking to a minor at the text was revealed earlier today. So we can go through the text messages, but let's see what Kyle Sinat got going on in response to the situation. What the f is going on with everybody dealing with these minors? Um, I asked her to confirm the iMessage, to confirm the number. It's confirmed. All right, all that is confirmed. And I'm just sick and tired of having to do like this. Because it's like, damn, my nigga, like, 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 just like, like, I don't know how people are not just seeing something or like an age or something and just saying and just stopping. You feel me? It was just some messages that it's, it's like a, it's some messages that looks crazy, bro. You feel me? I'm not, I'm gonna keep it. I'm not sugarcoating. This look crazy, bro. And this shit me up the whole day, gang. Like the whole day. Me up, cause like, nigga, what the are you doing? Like, what are you doing? Like, nigga, I had a, I have a whole vision. Like, yeah. How I want. Damn. I need to stop crying. Like, nah, cause it's, it's like crying. second, th second, third time going through this. Somebody who helped me start my whole. Chris V. Oh, this nigga? Oh. Ah, let me tear. Oh my god. I'm trying to chill. I'm sorry, chat. Like. This is why people tell me the live shit not the best option. Yeah. But real you gonna get me. Yeah. Everybody tell me don't go live, don't like, but it's the realest you're gonna get me. Like he keep getting he keep getting put in these the situations. You're gonna be able to get me and be able to like do my and I just this, this is how honest I feel like I can be with y'all niggas. You feel what I'm saying? Um, it's unfortunate. What's the text? What's the tech? What's the moves going forward? I know I don't with this. I know I don't I don't like any of this to be around me. I don't like this. I don't condone this. This is up. It is crazy how 
randomly like all, all like it's just like so if this guy this the guy right here if y'all watching the amp videos or stuff like that so he's crying because this dude was caught revealed to be texting a minor and this is a guy that's you know a cameraman that works with them a lot amp and kai kai feels like he you know he helps help them start a lot with his career that's crazy he was fired no longer part of amp staff so we had the text messages right here let's get to him so amp cameraman chris v is currently being called out for allegedly being inappropriate with a minor that is 17 years old the 17 year old girl has a po has posted a thread exposing screenshots in imsg ims chats showing text messages between her and chris so let's let's see let's see what's up all right so, um, he says, I wasn't kidding. I, w um, I actually wanted to get to know you. He's all oh, laugh my f***ing ass off. You're cool, but respect respectfully. I'm actually 17. My friends told me to say I'm 19, but you know, I got to let you know the truth. He says, nah, that's crazy. I respect you telling me, though. No cap. She says, yeah, I didn't want to do you like that. He says, you cool, you cool though. Good vibes. I was actually serious, though, if you was 19. And, and let me... I forgot this oh. He says you had me confused too. Okay, you had me confused. Oh, what you mean? Whoa, whoa. Let's keep pushing. Let's keep pushing. Okay. Um, what you mean? I was just laying down out of nowhere. I hear Chris. Like people recognize me all the time, but I don't know why it caught me off guard. She says, Yeah, the first time I ran into you guys, and then after the skip, my friends were like, Oh, that's Chris. Y'all y'all was on Discord. And um, and then when I ran into you again, they wanted me to ask you to make sure it's actually you. Yeah, I forgot. I forgot. I don't know. What, what you know about this score? What you mean I got this score? I play video games. This ain't enough. Um, see, she says um, she said you see that's different. I was gonna say normally only girls who are into video games know about this score. What you playing? At the moment, I've been playing Call of Duty. You nice? Of course I'm nice. Stop it just because you said of course. I know you're not nice. 1v1, you don't want no smoke. Whenever you die for 1v1, let me know. So, wait, wait, is this before or after? This shit, like, just got real. This is test messages. Okay. okay. Like, I could just imagine, just imagine rubbing my put my, my ink on your puss. I'll put my whole ink on your throat. Just pick a keg up and put you on your side. Put your leg and put you on your side. And just slowly unk you while I choke you. No joke, my it hard as F right now. Just for you. I'm so unking hard with the funk. You going, what, what you going to do about it? You would let me F you like right now, right now? Unsee, probably done what is it? Wow. So she was 17 at a time, for sure, for sure. Oh, nah, my boy, you're done. You're cooked. You're cooked. What's this? Okay, it's some more. Shit. Okay. All right, hold on. It's some more. You cooked, my boy. Because I'm thinking, this she, is it, is it years ago or whatever? I don't know. It says, uh, the victim claims that she reached out to Kai and has seen multiple times but received no mess, no response. Hi, Kai. I recently seen a clip about you speaking on the Ava in Mr. B situation. I do want to let you know that Chris, your cameraman, is definitely a pedo. Oh. So, since Kai was speaking about the situation with Mr. B's, someone said, you got some around you too that's on the same type of timing. And you need to be careful because just like Mr. Beast is going through what he's going through, you could be in the same situation. That's what's going on. Um, CP artists appreciate you, dog. Kylie says uh, she, she deleted messages. There's no way. That happens a lot, man. That happens a lot. All right, so it says, Hi, Kai. I recently seen a clip about you speaking, of, speaking on the Ava and Mr. B situation. I do want to let you know that Chris, your cameraman, is definitely a pedal, pedal too. So she's saying for sure. I remember when coming. I remember coming across him on OMETV while I was on Discord sharing my screen to my friends. 
They told me that his name is Chris and that he is AMP's cameraman. I said, hi, Chris, which got his attention because he was curious. I knew his name. He asked for my age. I lied and said 19 because my friends told me to, and I just went with it. He asked for my Insta. I gave it. As soon as he DM'd me, I told him my real age because I know it's not really cool to lie about, um, about that. And from there, I thought he was going to stop answering, but then it led to him being down for a 1v1 on card which I thought was fine. Later on, it turned out to him being flirtatious and then texting me wild shit. So the text messages was after that point. Wow. Okay. So later it turned out to him being flirtatious and texting me wild shit. You shouldn't say to a minor. During this time, I just turned 17. I am now 19. This happened December 2021, February, March 2022. I will gladly show you all the screenshots. I have to prove this. We also use FaceTime. I remember there was a time he passed the phone to you, and I was telling you that I could also beat you on a 1v1. I don't know if this helps you remember me. Damn, you gonna put your homie on some bullshit? Damn, why would you put your homie on... on, on uh, you talking to a minor, don't put... Oh, fuck, Chris, you gotta go. You gotta go. You you, you already doing some you ain't supposed to be doing. You gonna put Kai on the phone with her? Oh. Oh. Fuck. Bruh. It's some more shit? Oh. It's, we already read these things. We already read these things. That's how I feel. So he probably sent a video of him doing some some nasty. We're probably doing something inappropriate right here that we cannot show on this. Um, so she says right here, I started to distance myself in a way it wasn't too noticeable. Nah, you really don't fuck me no more. Oh, he felt like he getting dubbed by a little ass chick. He acting like um y'all boy from Toronto on that one song he got on Certified Lover Boy, Mad at 21 year old W. Um, okay. Why you never pick up? Miss FaceTime call. He mad that the miners dubbing him. I see somebody in the comment section saying, not hard to fake this. <sighs> why would someone fake this random guy? Like, hey, why him? He's not, like, super famous like that. He's just a cameraman. That's my, th my thoughts. Maybe, maybe fake, but why him? I don't know. Okay, now, after all of that complex thought, the person that they were referring to was Chris. You see the article right here. This Chris right there. Crazy. Now, listen to Kyle's response after they, you know, played themselves on some, on some silly yeah, I had the nerve to put out a false article about one of the AMP members, and all you had to do was do 30 seconds of research. Hey, bro, listen to me. Chris next door ain't do. He's not part of any situations. He ain't do. He's one of the quietest. When you talk about Chris next door, he's literally minding his business. He don't do. He has yet to even come on your platform. He has yet to even do a lot of within his personal lane, my nigga. So for y'all niggas to do that is absolutely crazy. And I know. We have a lot of shit that we were supposed to do in the future, Complex. There's a lot of shit that y'all wanted me for. I'm going to go ahead and cut that tie right there, bro. Just because a dumbass nigga who wrote an article and him being my mans, bro, I'm not working with I'm not. I ain't doing shit for Complex until further notice, nigga. That shit was ridiculous, bro. It just takes five seconds of research, my nigga. Nigga, what the f Nigga, that's so. Alright, now this was Chris' response initially after saying this. this is, they linked the man. Chris, they. God damn. God, he's saying you don't want to do shit with y'all niggas no more, bro. I know hey, I know y'all wasn't probably going. Y'all probably wasn't going to do shit with me. I, I, let's be real. Y'all called me the cameraman. Um, But, like, it's like for real, bro. It's it's crazy. But, look, man, um, Complex, Uh, we do have the lawyers looking over. We'll be dealt with. Um. Shit would be dealt with, uh, for real. Um, like. How many don't even know what to say, bro? So damn pissed off, dog. Okay, so that was that right there, man. Y'all let me know what y'all gotta say about all that in the comment section below. I'm going to get about it here, though. This is another update with Stace. Yo.